The views and opinions expressed by the host and our guests do not state or reflect those of the T and MZ show. This is T. And this is MZ Dog. And we're back with our special guest, Josh. Hey. Josh. Yeah, I'm here. Oh, it was hot in here. Was you hot? Yeah, I was. I was really hot. Somebody had the devil in him. <laughs> Man, they had the AC turned on. <laughs> Die. <laughs> I, I'm yeah. glad y'all better now. Yeah. Now I that didn't you got wanna, winter coming through the door. Yeah, they want to sue you. I'm glad. I tried to lose some weight, but I ain't want to be in no sauna. Right, right. So we're going to continue where we left off. We were talking about black women dogging black men. Not, no, not dogging, not dogging, but because you got to look at it for two ways. Or tearing down. Tearing down. I, I'll, I'll do that tearing down because dogging means you don't cheat on with three dudes in one night. That's, that's dogging. But tearing them down means you ain't shit. It's you ain't, you ain't got a Correct. You ain't got a job you, or your job don't make enough. You didn't. Mm-hmm. I had a girl. Like, this is no lie. Um, we, our relationship broke up because her family, because all her family is Ivy League, oh, Ivy, yeah. ed, Ivy League educated and mm-hmm. either went to University of Miami, which is a private school. Mm-hmm. So her family, they're all lawyers and doctors. Now, remember, I was, I'm an incarcerated felon. So they was like, oh, no, no. not that nigga. Mm-mm. Anybody but him. But we had a good relationship. We're still, we're still friends now. So I just told her, hey, listen. I'm not finna come between you and your family. That makes no sense. Go ahead with your family. I mean, there's, there's like billions of women out there, like lots of them. So even even white ones, you know, even <laughs> Spanish and <laughs> Korean and Puerto Rican. And we don't got to do this. <laughs> we got. And she, she was Jamaican. Throwing some of the shoes at you if you'd have said that to me. <laughs> yeah. Why? Your family said the family said I wasn't good enough for y'all. I mean, I, I went to University That's of Phoenix. To hurt her feelings. University of Phoenix. I went to University of Phoenix. <laughs> and, uh, uh, <laughs> hey, I, I went to Tallahassee Community College. Hey, right. I got I got an AA and a BA, so I'm, I'm good. Right. It don't, I don't care where you got it from. You got it. Right. And it's what you're doing because you know some people can go to those schools and still don't have a job. They be homeless on the side of the road eating bait. You know. So. Right. But what I'm saying is this. Back to what I was saying. My, my Korean friend, she was like, Josh, why are black women so hard on you guys? Write books. March, sing songs, make TV shows, all that kind of stuff. And she was like, the other races don't do that. They all have problems within their own race. But don't you believe that it goes back to slavery? Think well, about a slavery it, it does. time. It does. It? The master had to turn the woman against her husband when they took off the husband and the kids. Everybody was turned against each well, other. Well, I explained that to and her. And that has I not changed. Well, I explained that to her. But what, she's, what she did say is, what she did say and what all white people say, that was 500 years ago. It don't matter. It's in our blood. We've carried it on through generations. But like me, I don't celebrate holidays. We don't either. Well, the reason why I say that is because some people are, you could be programmed to do certain things, but it's up to you to stop. Yeah. Dogmatic. That's right. It's up to you to stop it. You, you don't have to it, do it because everyone's doing it. It's easier said than done, though. It is, but I just stopped doing it. It just yeah. start with one person. It's, well, it starts with it one person. It could start like with it. one person, but... There's generations and generations of that that has happened. Correct. Hundreds of years. Hundreds of years. Absolutely. And you're trying to take what, what she was saying is this. OK, you take a lady, you take you take a take a you take a Cuban lady, take a white woman, you take a Asian lady and they marry a black guy, date him, whatever it may be. And they'll have a great lasting relationship unless you're uh, what's the lady name I was dating was married to Chad Ocho Cinco that thinks she black. Oh yeah. Now, now, uh, now, now if you heard, yes, yes, yeah. Yes. Now, now if you, cause she grew up in the projects in Miami. Yeah. So she's a different breed. She yes. grew up. Yeah. She didn't grow up. Evelyn. Uh, yeah. Evelyn. Mm-hmm. She, she didn't grow up. She didn't grow up, you know, just around her people. She grew up, you know, snatching pocketbooks and all that other stuff. Mm-hmm. So when you do all that kind of stuff, she, 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 she has a, she's a different, she's a different breed, but you take somebody like, uh, you take somebody from a nice area, um, and she's not used to the uh, guy that's from the hood or the project, whatever you want to call it, the low-income area, and she doesn't understand the plight of that guy. She don't understand what he had to go through, the hardships, she can't relate. where the black woman relates to it. Mm-hmm. But instead of lifting him up, she expects him to be Superman. When the white woman or the other woman she expects him to just be a man. There's the difference. Well, there's some flip into that too, though. You can't flip that. Yeah, you know why you can't flip it? Because you are a black woman. You expect this man to rise up out of order like a phoenix. 
and yeah, sore. Check it out. She though. don't care. Check it out, though. If a black woman didn't have that type of mentality and she's raising a son in the ghetto, what's she going to teach her son? That's that's a good one. But what she can teach her son is this. If she by herself. She by herself. She got to teach him how to Why be a man. she by and herself? The only way he going to survive is by being Why she got to teach him by herself? Because when I grew up, the project raised everybody. If I did something well, wrong, everybody then. whooped what about us. now? Well, now it's a different story. We, we, we just talking about the whole, the overall picture. Right. right. The overall picture from then to now to, think about it. He can go date this white girl. She, and listen, this is what I'm saying. Okay. She doesn't have all of that problem. She doesn't have the stigmatization. She don't have anything going on with her. So, they. Can, That's easy. Correct. But what I'm saying is she's not putting him down on every corner. She's not expecting him to be a, she's not expecting she him to save. To be a man and not Superman. Right. That's right. That. So I you black women want us to be, okay, you already know where we come from. You know what we're up against. Right. Right. So we have to overcome that, go to college or go get a job. The white girl don't know all that. She never saw that. Well, you know, you see that all the time. Cause I sometimes Tina and I are together and I'll be like, Dang, how'd she get him? Or you know, in well, let her go back to what he's saying. Yeah, exactly. She got yeah. him because, because she's, she's building him up. up. Right. We, Even if it's just with her words. That's right. right. She got so him. So we're tearing him down with our words. Right. With the words and the actions because right. you take a guy, most neighborhoods, where, where, where you from in Chicago? South side? South side. You from, you, you from here? Michigan. You from Michigan. So you from a small town? Yeah. Okay. In a small town, you take, in a small town, there's 20 popular guys. And it's all over the United States. There's 20 popular guys. And there's 50,000 women that want to sleep with those 20 popular guys. That's why those 20 popular guys got all the kids in that area. Right. Now, there's another. This, this is a true story. No matter where you go at. Now, there's another 1,000 guys that are unpopular. That have jobs. That are going off college. That are, you don't want them because nobody else wants them. Yeah. So, the white girls, they never got a chance. You never got a chance. The guy that was not popular, he wanted you. But you wanted one of the 20. Yeah. So, but that white girl, that Asian girl, that Puerto Rican girl wanted him. So when he goes off and marries, you're like, oh, Johnny think he all that because he got a white one. No. Johnny tried to talk to you three times, remember? And you told Johnny no because you wanted one of the 20 popular guys. The bad guy. It it doesn't have to be a bad guy. He's he's a popular guy. That's why every city you go to in a black neighborhood, there's 20 guys or maybe 40, 60 that have all the kids. He got 16. He got 20. He got eight. He got nine. And it's all from sisters and family members and they're all fighting. That's true. It's all on Facebook. They're fighting because you never gave these guys a chance. Right. Now when they go off and they go married, they go to the military and they come back with their white wife or their Puerto Rican wife, you're like, what do you think you got going on? The thing too now is that, okay, Okay, so that is a true fact, and now it has complete. It has completely flipped over where the black man don't even hardly get a sister a look. That's that's not true. I'm black, and I, I date. Yeah, I just two, I date two, one thousand. No, 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 no. Have you ever been to McKinney? I've been all over Florida. I'm from, I'm from Florida, so there's. Right. I, I see it all the time. So, I see, but that's listen. Listen, well, what I'm saying. You don't think that's a truism? No, because if you take a hundred black men, maybe twenty out of that or twenty seven out of that went outside their race. Yeah. So you look. You're looking at a very small picture. Okay. That 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 you're looking at. You're all looking right. at something very small. Okay. So you got to think. Go to the black neighborhood. Oh yeah. Then it's all black on black. Oh. So when you go yeah. to the, when you go to a mixed neighborhood, you're gonna see black More couples. Black. You're, you're gonna, gonna see mixed couples and black. Right. You're gonna see it. Right. But it's still gonna have the black guys with a black woman. So every now and then. No, that's not true. No, you see it. No, it's not you true. You see it, but you maybe see the it guys that you maybe the guys that you think are for you or that you're trying to look at maybe. No. But as a whole, no. No, 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 no. You you frequent places like uh, uh, popular night spots here in in, in the Dallas area, uh-huh. Addison area. All black. You don't. Yeah, come on, man. It's those and those people live somewhere. Yeah, they live somewhere. But the world is changing, don't you agree? The world is changing, but not so far as that. Because in the seventies, my dad told me there's there's a lot of black guys that dated white women. Yeah, that that, 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 that ain't changed. Was, yeah, that, that, that that's but never changed. But it seems changed. to be more not just black and white, but it's black and Asian, black. Well, and I I just told you why. Indian. I just told you, you know, why. It's all mixed well, up still, now, and I think it's a beautiful think, thing. I think it's a beautiful thing. Well, I beautiful still think ugly. that black men prefer black women. They well, do. And just I like think, a black woman prefer a black yeah, man. Yeah, I still think that's yeah. highly ranked. Because up. it's more in common. You think right. Beyonce would have talked to Jay-Z if he was working at Walmart? No. No. If both of them were working at Walmart. Not yes. just, not yes. just. I don't think she would have talked to him, but both of them were at Walmart. Yeah. I think because he's not that attractive. She would have picked somebody else. Uh, 
See what I'm saying? That, that's because that's, that's that's what I'm saying. He's Both not them, cute. Okay, so right. she's only with but him for one reason. But that's his point. That's right. So if they both are working at Walmart, she don't want him. Right. Ugly ass, big little boy. Don't you talking to me? So that's what she gonna <laughs> tell him. But I'm just saying. But he's 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 famous. He's a celebrity. The guys. Once you get money, you look good. You, you do look, look real. Shaba good. Ranks. Absolutely. I heard women call him Shaba Ranks ugly, oh but but they, were, they they loved him. And Flavor yes. Flav. Flavor yes. Flav. And, and he get the women. That's right. right. Well, yeah. He does. Like yeah. But yes, it's a TV show. Don't, don't get it twisted. They, they, it, it was all scripted <laughs> out. <laughs> it's all scripted. But uh. But I saw his baby mama. And yeah. He, and she didn't do. T- he didn't do too bad. No, because he and little Wayne. A, a couple of dollars. A couple of dollars. Yeah. A couple, a couple of dollars would make you look good. A lot of dollars make you look the best man in the world. Right. Yeah, because you could be you could be uh <laughs> you could be a midget bitch with bull. <laughs> Listen, y'all, you a woman, so you already know. Money make you look good or change your style of dress. Yeah. So money can change your style. You may not be attractive, but you smell good. You dress good because I've gained I've gained sweat. seventy pounds, and I still get the same when I got when I was slimmer. So it don't mm-hmm. it don't matter. Don't bother me. They don't. I mean, because I'm I'm confident. So I, I don't care who you are. If I want to talk to you, I'm gonna talk to you. So if you're gonna say no, I don't have no problem with you saying no. So what? It's fifty of you in so, here. So do you believe? Okay, going back to the somebody subject. go. It's a numbers game. Somebody okay. gonna say, "Oh, hey, fat boy, yo, Josh, <laughs> yo, Josh." What's you up? ain't gonna hear no all the time, yo, Josh. Nah. So do you believe that um, interracial couples uh, they last longer? Yeah, because they have a struggle. Well, not they all la- of them struggle. They last longer because they have a struggle. I dated white men before. But well, they last and, longer? Yeah, because you spend a lot of time just trying to stay together because other people are trying to pull you apart. So as a unit, it makes you stronger. Now, that's that. You know what? That's the first time I heard that, but that could be true. Yeah. But what I'm saying, because yeah, depending on where you live at, excuse me, depending on where right. you live at, if you live somewhere that's like Seattle, mm-hmm. No one cares about what color, what you, color are. you are. They don't care if you're blue. California. Yeah, they, yeah. It, it depends on where you live at. Just, but if you live in Mississippi. That's the problem. Uh, you might not have a house when you come home. <laughs> <laughs> you might not have. Still to this day. Of course. Wow. It never changed. It's not going to change. Wow. Yeah, I, I've, I've lived in Florida, and a lot of people don't know Florida is. Alabama. Times three. Yes. They don't get it because they, don't, they only know about Tampa, Orlando, and Miami. Uh-huh. But the panhandle in North Florida is. They ain't having it. What? Don't mm-hmm. they still have signs say go the other way? Don't get caught <laughs> to this day in 2019. They still have signs out that say don't go the other way. <laughs> don't get your black. Don't at a certain time. Don't be caught out, and they mean that. It's not, and the police not going to do anything about it because so, you don't have no business there. So I have something that's been in the back of my mind that I that I wanted to share. I I have a, a client, and he's white, and he married a Korean woman, and. He said that she's the meanest person he ever, ever met. They, he's trying to stay together with her. He said, but they don't believe in affection. They don't believe in love. No. They just believe in making money. That's a culture. So you got exactly. you to remember, yeah. you marry into a, a culture. culture. So and a lot of times the cultures do not mix. The cultures don't mix. No, they don't. Yeah. And that's the struggle. Well, they can mix if you're on her page. Right. So them, other races care about wealth. They care about they care about money. They mm-hmm. care about these things. Maybe not so much as a. <laughs> that's that's a topic for another day. But other other races care about money. This is why the Korean people here in America, yeah. the Korean that's people, all she care about the Korean because she's been taught that. That's all. With your wealth, he you said can she don't even hug her kids. She don't kiss her. Well, kids. think about she this. Do, With your wealth, stuff. you can what. Insulate mm-hmm. yourself to a bunch of BS that goes around in the world. And they're taught that even African people, when they come over here, the women are taught to marry a white man. Really? They're, yeah, they're teaching that. The reason why, because if you marry an American white man. No, they won't have nappy hair. Well, that's one. That's one. But the, <laughs> if, if that, the, thing, the, thing, the thing about it is, the thing about it is, you have to, they're thinking about <laughs> wealth. <laughs> they're thinking about wealth but you got to remember this think about them buck shots well buck shots buck shots are good yeah but if you marry you know I, I, used to, I used to cuss people out I really did I had to get over this do. I think you still no do. no no I had to get over this I, I used to cuss I, well I won't say people I used to cuss black women out and the reason why I used to cuss them out because I used to hate when they say that good hair or bad hair well there's yeah. no such thing that's something that what you just said a minute ago that goes back to slavery I know, Your hair but, is but, supposed to be nappy. A lot, it is supposed to be nappy. <laughs> but, but you're black. Is, 
But my yes. hair is not nappy. Well, mine mm-hmm. ain't either. We're not saying that. No. What I'm saying is <laughs> your hair is your nappy. hair is naturally kinky as a black Absolutely. person. Absolutely. No, you I disagree. No, no, no. You have a lot of other stuff in you. No, I don't. Yes, I'm 100 percent you almost like no, you ain't. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Look at me in your color. Are you crazy? What's wrong with you that? You not no Mandingo? <laughs> I <laughs> wrote you. You, you. you look like. Do you think you look like Michael Blackson? Yes. <laughs> no, you don't. You look more like. You look more. Yeah. Look in the kitchen. You look more like what? <laughs> look in the kitchen. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm saying. You got. You got to understand. If you do your. If you have you done your. No, your I have tree? not. Yeah, you gonna find seventy percent. Uh, um, <laughs> you from the <laughs> mountains or somewhere. You guarantee you got a lot of that in you. <laughs> I can tell by the point of your nose. You ain't you ain't got no uh you ain't got no Samuel Jackson nose. What's wrong with you, girl? Cut it out. <laughs> Talking about your hair ain't nappy. Of course you part Korean. <laughs> that, that's why you do 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 your family tree and find out that you some kind of Trump. Hmm, I, have to, oh, no. I have to do that now. You might. We can tell me give some money, cause. <laughs> but this this the thing. Going back to the Korean lady, they're they're taught wealth. I have a I have a um I have a friend from um he's from Pakistan. Yeah, it's hot in here. She free listen. I have a friend from Pakistan and you know they they own all the stores. Right. Yes. Mm-hmm. Well you didn't you, Everybody think that the government just gives the money. That's not no, true. That's no, not true. that's not true. That that's that's, that's some myth. Generational money. Th- that's some myth. That's some myth mm-hmm. that somebody started. And they help each other. Oh, of course, that's what yeah, they do. Yeah, they do. And, but, they, and and if you look at it, because I saw this driving up and down uh, Preston, they actually have their own banks. Oh, they do. And their banks lend yeah, to them. Yeah, they do. Duh. Yeah. Uh-huh. So this is what this is what they, other every races, races do right. besides us. No. Right. Besides, besides American, American blacks, yeah, because blacks over in other countries have their own banks. They have their, mm. they come over here and take advantage of Again, our lax laws back to for commerce mm-hmm. and take the money back home. But, this, but back to what you were saying about the, your uh, your client and, and his wife, she's taught that she's taught she was taught to marry white. If you're going to marry anything outside of a white person, a outside Korean of person. Korean. Marry white. The same thing with Nigerians. The same thing with anything. The only ones who marrying black is the Kardashians. Nobody else is marrying. <laughs> they ain't got because they want what they want. They got the money. Right. They got the money. Right. So we don't need the money. We need what they got. We want that. So all the other stuff, that's all the other stuff is out the door. But if you're teaching your child to marry, I, I used to date an African girl. She wouldn't let her kids read no, no black magazines, listen to no black music. Yeah, and I asked her why you date me then, and she was like, "Well, you know, for one thing, she didn't really like me. She just didn't want to get with them because she got the money. She got the money. Wow. But if she needed the money, I wouldn't have been. I would have been a non factor. Right. You see what I'm saying? I was out of the. I was out the picture. <laughs> but she teaching her daughters and her son. But her son wasn't with it. He was like, hm, whatever she said. Ain't got time for that. But her daughter was like, they used to call me the racist. You know why they call me the racist? No. Because I used to bring her daughter black magazine, like the YSB, the YSB, black magazine, and Essence, and Jet. And st- I was like, I said, no, we have our own magazine. We got, she's like, my mommy said we don't have those kind of magazines. I was like, what? Your mama told you that? And she's like, yes. And she's like, don't you show her nothing. I'm like, why? <laughs> she don't need to see that. Why are you showing her these magazines with people? And She needs to see her own people. And she's from Nigeria. That makes a lot of sense, though. You're from Nigeria. Why wouldn't you want to be? I, I never understood that. Like, but but think about it. If if you program your children to be idolizing other people in magazines and they don't respect and learn to appreciate their ancestors and the people from where they actually came from, well, it's kind of like what we're dealing with slavery with religion thing. and all the other stuff. Don't yeah. get it twisted. Right. The same thing she was doing to her daughters was the same thing that's been done to us systematically over the Absolutely. years. Absolutely. Well, that's why. But the the, the Korean, see, other people, other races know this. You think they don't know this, right? Of course they know this. Yeah, they see it. They yeah. know this. But what what they're saying, what she's saying is, why are y'all belittling and putting down the guy? They're saying why? That that that's what that's what she was asking, and she's saying hmm. we all they they all, they all go through the same problems, right? Yeah, <laughs> now, yeah. Now I do have a friend that says that that um. Africans don't like Americans. They don't. And my niece, she's up here now. She's moved. She's already in. She came up here, get herself together. But a lot of people at the job she works in Fort Worth are African. Mm-hmm. So she was talking to these African guys. So she you know she went on a date and they went you know talking. But she said she had to leave because the African people were putting down the black man. Now, 
keep in mind, she puts down a black man all the time. My niece does. But she said she had to, she she couldn't take it. I said, why you couldn't take it? You do this all the time. And she's like, because they said it. <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean? Because they said it. She's like, they don't talk about my black man. Oh, but you can. You see what I'm saying? Right. She feels like I can say that because I'm a black American woman. No. You ain't a woman. That's what I'm talking about, my niece. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm never be a woman. I got, I, I'm hanging and dangling. No, 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 no. <laughs> I ain't thinking about being a woman. I'm a man, man. <laughs> oh, man. Uh-huh. Yeah, that. Uh huh. <laughs> so, no. What I'm saying is. Well, I know one thing. African men love American black women. No, they don't. Yes, they do. They love the opportunity. They're opportunists. They're opportunists. They don't care nothing about you. Yes, they do. No, they don't. <laughs> No, they don't. You, okay. you, you, you provide. You provide what they call. You ever see when the playground? You see the slide. Uh-huh. You are the slide. They can slide right into American society. You are the slide. That's all you are. You're nothing. Wow. Don't get it twisted. They don't want you. They're already married. They're already married back home. <laughs> they are. That's not true for everybody. <laughs> but but majority of them, yes, they are. <laughs> listen, don't listen, man. <laughs> Don't listen. All right, we're gonna take a break and we'll be right (laughs) back. Yeah, because she she, 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 gotta tell her. This is T. And this is MZ. And we're back. We're back. Yes. Yes. And we're gonna uh, wrap up the show. We're gonna uh, let Josh get his final words in. And uh, yeah, because it's been one of those. Hey, listen. um, it's always exciting to come up here and talk to you guys because y'all don't never talk to me until it's time for the podcast. <laughs> yeah. y'all, y'all, aren't, y'all aren't genuine friends. Y'all don't check on me. We, we do check y'all on you, Josh. Y'all, okay, y'all, y'all don't know if my blood pressure up or Josh, did I get in a wreck or nothing. You stayed in Florida for a whole year. No, I didn't. I was gone for a month and I had to uh, get these people bodies together. Okay. Okay, so so moving forward. <laughs> moving forward. We're going to check on you. Look, that's what, hey, ain't no one that's all we got to do. We're going to check on you. But right. back back to back to uh, you guys. Uh, we're we going to be a black woman checking on a black man. Yeah, y'all need to and, check and on building a up We're going to build man. up a black man and that's support right. the black man. That's you right. have to because if no one does it from who's going to do it? And then you guys will get mad if someone else if does it. If another race does it. And so it's time to start supporting our black man. Absolutely. Well, you can't support. Not the Africans. You got <laughs> I don't know. Well, one, one thing about this. We don't want them to slide in. We can. Well, they, they, do, they do definitely it. slide down because before we came, that sound like. <laughs> that sound we like. Can. That sound like. Do it. Voodoo Uber too. But the, the, thing, the thing about it is. Cause that's where we that's where we left off at. We left off about you know uh, the Africans coming in and sliding in on American women. Right. But what I'm saying, we got to support. That was it. deep. We, we it was. We have to re, we have to support each other. Mm-hmm. Not only as the black women supporting the black man, but we have to men. We as men have to humble ourselves sometimes and support our black women because we can at times be a little intimidated. Mm-hmm. Not all of us, but some of us can be intimidated. And what we do, we get intimidated by a free car. thinking. No, a car is nothing. Nobody Independent can. thinking woman. Indep- yes, right. Independently thinking woman. And she has to understand that if you're going to let a man be head of that household or be in charge, she has to let him be a man. Not make mistakes, correct his mistake, but correct his mistakes in a way that is non-threatening to that man. Because <gasps> once you threaten a man, <laughs> once you threaten a black man, we come out swinging. Yeah. And I, I don't I don't mean that in a physical, physical form. Mm-hmm. We just come out swinging. We're gonna you know we're gonna protect our manhood. Absolutely. But the other races of women, they just let us they just let us do and let us be. Because we are lions, we are kings, we are And we are queens. You're hunters. We we are hunters and we we will we will hunt fifteen hundred women in, in, in a year's time if you let us. <laughs> but what I'm saying, and we, and we will put all y'all heads on the wall. But what I'm saying, stuff all y'all. But what I'm saying, but what I'm saying is this: speak on it. Well, this is truth. I know. That's why if you let every man have five girlfriends, will be all right and one wife. Well, you know that is the way it is done in other countries. Duh, they, why do they have to have five girlfriends? Guess what? Why? They figured it out. They figured it out because one man can't stick with one woman. I, I honestly, me, this is my personal opinion, so I don't need nobody uh, calling y'all or uh, texting y'all and saying that he cray-cray, but this is my personal opinion. I don't think one man can, 
And I'm saying some men can, but I don't think because you can have your wife put on 500 wigs. You can have your wife turn into all kind of different things, but she can't change her skin color. So if I want her to be, a, if, I, if I want her to be, if I want her to be a pale she can't seven it. foot white woman, she can't. Right. But I can go find one. Yeah, you could. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. If I want her to be a four foot uh, uh, Korean woman, she can't. But the challenge y'all face now. Is that the women turn around and do the same thing? You can't be no six foot five white man with long hair. I don't want to be hair. exactly, so but I don't want to be. So but, but if you can't be that, then she gonna go out and find them. Well, women, but that's what I'm saying. But thing about that is, we won't be labeled and talked about like you guys will be. That's true. That's, so we that's don't, not fair either. It is fair that's because not fair. I'm saying what's fair when y'all marched and said y'all want to be equal to us, equal pay, equal this, equal that. Why are you talking about old stuff? Because it, it trans <laughs> because it transcends up to the new stuff. Why are you talking about old stuff? Well, when you when you want to listen, I think there was a major mistake. We should have never done that. You should have never done it. And guess nope. what you'd have been doing? Nope. Guess what you'd have been doing? Still home, taking care of the house, and we'd have still been out there doing our thing. Sweating but by their nose. But you let but you let another race tell you what you should do. And when you went to marching. Because that race told you. So is that you, how we became angry black women? No, you, no that's later on. We've always been. <laughs> that's later. We're already that's angry. Later. Anytime somebody snatch you up from your home and take you 15,000 miles away, you're going to be angry. It doesn't matter. That, that, that's, we've been angry from the day that they bumped across the head and tricked us and told us that some gold was inside that ship. And we ran up in there looking for it. <laughs> we, we were angry then. <laughs> oh, we did that with chains on our ankles? and, and our, oh. No, no, they, just, they tricked you in there first because they didn't want to just put the chains on you at first. <laughs> They didn't want to put the chains on you, so they tricked you at first. They told you, hey, come over here. Guess what? See that? You see that goat sheep hair coat you got on? We got okay. like 7,000 of those. Hey, you're going off cue again. Okay, okay off cue. So okay, but, but yeah, I know. But guess what? This is what we're going to do. We're going to support each other. Yes. Okay. So nobody else can support each us okay and we won't have a problem with that because, like I said, the lady asked me, why do the black women not, not support and why are they so hard on, on the black, black man. man you know we could go into that like all night long because there's many reasons and, and it's it's an it individual is. thing it's not just a whole race because some black women do support their men well they do but on a scale because you gotta remember these people are outside looking in they only see what they see on tv and reading the magazines and hearing on here on the radio true. it's this not like they're true. in every neighborhood checking out what's going on mm-hmm. they're talking about what they see when they hear Beyonce sing a song or they hear um, Little Kim sing a song or they, you know. You know who was the greatest example? Who? Obama and Michelle. Great example of what? what? She supported her man. She, <laughs> well, she that wasn't a hard man to support. She supported her <laughs> man and she outright, I mean, it was the love. You could see that they, were, they admired and respected would each you other. Rep- would you support your man if he ran for president and became the president? Heck yeah. Would you support your man if he was working at McDonald's? Uh, if I was working with him, <laughs> no, no, no. We just, see, see, I'm saying this, there's a difference. There's, there's, there's a different level of support. So what I'm saying is, who wouldn't support their man running for the president and well, becoming I mean, the president? Not, look at uh, Melania and Trump. She don't support him. Oh, she, she can't stand him. She supports him, or she knows what's going to happen. But she, she can't stand cray. him. So don't say every woman would do it. She still support him, president. But she still support him. Not, not she don't like, agree. Not like Michelle did. Oh, she's supporting. Believe me, she stands behind. She stood behind him. You could always tell she was right. Melania just be mad that stuff he be saying in the back when y'all don't see it, and he be cracking them jokes. That's why she be slapping his she hand. She be slapping his hand. Yeah, because <laughs> he don't say it's a little exactly. in her face or something. Because exactly. he, he, he's who he is. But right. she supports him. What? Who's not gonna support the president? A, a woman. Your man is a. Your man is a world leader. Uh, and. And support and agreeing <laughs> with him are it's two, two different, different things. things. That's right. Right. So but, she just because oh, she, she disagree, oh, she's disagree doesn't mean she doesn't support. I'm not on the mic, but I agree with you. I don't. I, I don't think the really the reason why she's is because she's got that Putin connection. Correct. And, she, and Trump can't touch her. Right. That's right. He better. He know not to touch. He her. know not right. to touch her because that that might be Putin's Putin. <laughs> <laughs> Putin's Putin. <laughs> and you you know better. She could divorce him. She'll be gone, She'll be gone. Well, in a New York minute. Well, he's been he's been divorced how many times? But she know. can't leave. See, <laughs> she can't. She can't leave. 
Yeah. As long as he's president, right? Mm-hmm. And that's right. Okay. But I mean, hey. Why can't she? Putin? It's against the law. No. No, it's against it's law. It's against, against Putin. Some rule. It's, it's some Putin. rule. What's the rule? No, it's not a rule. It's not a rule. It's she, but it never could. It's she, never they, happened they, in they wouldn't do it. They wouldn't do it. They wouldn't do it. They wouldn't do it. I mean, a woman probably wouldn't do it, but I'm like, it's not a law. She, saying would, she can't she do it. She would get sick it. real quick if she did. Yeah, um, she, she, she'd be coughing and, and yeah. come up with some kind of disease and fall over and cry. But like, like, like I say, man, we have to we have to support each other, man. Black we can't be successful like other races and you know, until we, we start su- supporting each, each other. And, and, totally and that's agree. a true statement. I totally agree with you, but it just don't go across the board like that. Everybody don't, don't. hear it and feel it like that. They like, don't. Well, guess we what? We can here, start we can with the small group. Yeah. You can start well, with a small group. I got like nine women. I can't support all of them. Well, <laughs> you're going to have to let but, some of your but, women But go. they all support me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't mess with them. <laughs> Listen, they, we, we got this thing figured out, man. We got hours and days and we got this thing down to the science. Don't mess that up. <laughs> Just stay <laughs> over there with y'all support. See, that's, that's part of the problem. It's that, not a problem. That is a problem. That's the problem that black women have. I'm open book. And that's why. I'm open book. I don't lie. I see as much support because you don't stick with one black woman. Thank you. Thank but you, T. I can't stick with one. Well, you need to stick with one and make a run with that but one. But that one. A, you don't need none. But that one isn't. A combination of all of them. Then you got then you got the wrong you one. Well, that's what I'm trying to find. But you, you don't need nine of them. I'm trying to find the one. You don't need nine of them. I don't need nine. What about eight? You can't even handle <gasps> eight. I'm handling nine now. No, you think you handling nine. No, no, no. Because I don't listen. When they're away from me, I could care less. Okay. I only deal what's with me. Okay. What's oh. what's around the corner? I could care less. That's, see, that's how my world rock. I don't. Listen. But you have too many of them. You have too many. I think I'm going to get nine more. You only I'm need gonna get 18. one. You only need no, one. Sir. Why do I need to get why, why do I need to get one? <laughs> Explain to me why I need one. You only need one woman and make a good run. How many homes one you have? I, why? How many Hold up. How many purses you have? <laughs> I have, I have about, I, hold on. Hold on. We're talking, about, we're talking about human feelings. But you're having you're having Emotions. you're having those things are emotional to you. No, they're not. Let it burn down. No, That's what happens. Not. You're no, faint right not. now today. Oh, God, Jesus. <laughs> where were you? Not where, where, Louis. <laughs> where, where, where were you, Jesus, when my Louis burnt? <laughs> Come back. Please, 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 please. Yeah, have a barrel for it. But what, what I'm saying is this. I tried the one thing. I tried the one thing. Twice. You, you twice. tried the one thing no, 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 but, with the wrong person. No, these, 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 were, these, were, these were all right people. What happened was outside influence. This will happen. This was, that's what happened. <laughs> well, you didn't have a mature woman. <laughs> they were mature, but I, I, I agree Not to let go. Not by age. No, no. I'm talking about I don't want no. I would never want you. If you and I was dating and you and your family was like, ah, I ain't finna go through all that because that's a lifelong thing. Right. And I I, me personally. Well, see her mistake was she told you what her family said. Oh, I heard them. They told oh, me. They told you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. She didn't tell me nothing. They told me. But my thing is this. I, as a man, wouldn't want to put you through that. So I said, well, you know thank what? Thank you for sparing me. No, I, I, I wouldn't do that because you have to, that's something you have to deal with all, all the time. And then you and I as being one gonna have to deal with that. And I ain't gonna do that because I will be done punch Mary Beth in the throat. <laughs> so me and Mary Beth ain't finna be arguing all the time. And you wouldn't have to. That's why I back up. Now you see what I'm saying? I, uh, but you don't have to back up and have nine women. That's all I'm saying. No, no, no. Until I can get who I want. Okay. So. Beyonce ain't single. Oh, okay. When she her and Jake do what they got. Yeah, y'all say <laughs> what's up, babe? <laughs> but that still does. Uh, Tina's valid. That's a valid point she made about why black women have such a hard time respecting black men because of that very thing that you're doing. Yeah. Well, that's 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 not why you don't respect black men. It's pretty yes, hard to support. Hard. That. Yeah, it is hard. Well, to no, support got, it. no, I'm talking about that's a different guy because I'm single. It's not like I was dating one person. If I was dating one person, that's a different story. If I was dating one person, well, to, to those try to eight get, women do they not think they're just the one person? No, they all know that just somebody else. No, they ask me, do I got friends? I tell them, yeah, I don't lie. Well, you have you friends, but we all have. <laughs> no, but he's right you, here. He's playing on words. Yeah. I don't play on words. You just said if, if they, they ask, ask me you if you have friends, I say yes. But that's not that's not what you have. You have other. I don't know. Are you sexual with these nine women? No, all nine of them. No, okay. no, five of them. <laughs> <laughs> the other four ain't gave it up yet. <laughs> I'm waiting on them. I'm holding out. <laughs> Where they at? But you know, it does get expensive because when you get you when you have to get protection, that's shit is expensive. You know how much rubbers go? <laughs> yeah, rubbers go. And, uh, there you go again. You're, that's you're veering off. No, I'm not. Yes, I'm just telling them what's going on. Don't tell them what's going on. But what, what we have to do is 
<laughs> if I got one woman, because I've had one woman before, so you preaching, and I'm not a cheater. You preaching it, but you you what would you call it? That's not cheating. I'm well, not. He's, I'm not he with said, them because he's saying he's Good telling them about. Good luck with that. I know that's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pray for me. But what what I'm saying is this: I'm not dating exclusively. Okay. You see what I'm saying? Now, if well, I was dating one difference. person, that's a major difference. I would support her, and she would support me. Okay. That's two different things. Okay. But I'm not. Da- I'll give you that I, one. I'm not asking to be with her or be with her or be with her or be with her. I don't want man one of them. Wow. Okay. They out all offer five, different things. Out of, out of five women, you don't want either. either none no, of them. Hugh Hefner had a whole harem. Nobody say nothing for you ain't 75. You, I'm, you ain't you. I'm, bl- I'm Blue Hefner. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't Hugh yet. I got to well, get new. <laughs> <laughs> well, on that note, we're going to go ahead and wrap up the. T an ra- MC show. Hey, it was, it was nice y'all having me. Yeah, yes. thanks, Josh. And we look forward to seeing you again or hearing from you again. I know that's right. All right. Good night, everyone. You the man. Good night. <laughs>